Well, here we are at the end of day two. Very disappointing day here at the Gabba Mickey. Uh, not one ball bowled. Yeah, really disappointing. You know, we had an opportunity this morning uh, with the second new ball, one that uh, I know our bowlers wanted to, wanted to have. Um, it was another bite of the cherry for us. We probably didn't execute as well as we could have yesterday. Um, so disappointing. It's taken a, a, a huge chunk out of the game, but um, you know, there's still a lot of cricket to be played here. Indeed. Now, the, the crowd that turned up today, not a big crowd by any means, but really patient. They stuck around for a long, long time. Yeah, they have stuck around for a long, long time. And I think that's just uh, testimony to to how big the series is, you know. So, uh, yeah, hopefully tomorrow we get a good crowd again, we get some good weather and we can play some good test cricket for them. Yeah, a bit of a distraction for the players too. I mean, they were able to get out and sign some autographs and say good day and shake some hands. It's a, it's good that they, you know, get out there and get involved. Oh, it is. You know, it's one of one of our values, one of our cultures is is being the best we can possibly be on and off the field. And I think that's uh, that comes with the job, that comes with the responsibility of... Uh, of being a, a, a contracted player for Australia. I just wanted to quickly touch on JP Dumini yesterday afternoon. The Achilles injury is uh, oh, it's a tragedy. Yeah, it is a tragedy. J JP's a fine player and really, really disappointed that the, the public of Australia won't see him play again. But um, yeah, we just wish him well. Okay, let's uh, keep our fingers crossed for some sunshine tomorrow. Yeah, let's hope so.